It is currently 11 degrees outside and I am so cold. I'm so sorry that I haven't got the chance to do all the crazy and fun things that I said that I probably would, but it has been so cold outside and so rainy that I haven't had the chance to really leave the house a number of occasions to go and enjoy it outside. So if I have gone out, it's usually been to a cafe or a club to meet up with friends. But tomorrow I'm off to the city to catch up with a few friends over a couple of drinks at a really cool nightclub called Revolver. Now, I don't know if anyone knows that club, but it's pretty notorious for being 24 hours on the weekend. It's kind of crazy, but I'm not going there to get kind of off tap. One funny thing is that my Australian accent has come back, so it's kind of really, really weird, but I mean... <laughs> I can deal with that. I'd, it'd be a little bit more popular back in Canada, I'm sure of it. Well, I'm looking forward to getting back home because a lot has been happening on the house and I've been missing a couple of people um, and I am kind of freaking out about work. I hate being away when there's no one there to do my job and I just can imagine the nightmare that I'm going to get when I get back. I'm also working on a very super secret project when I come back to Vancouver and that's going to be on full swing so look out for that. There'll be a teaser video coming out I think next week so fingers crossed. Now here's a 20 second photo break for a few photos of around Melbourne to give you an idea of where I've been hanging out. <laughs> again take care and thank you so much for subscribing um and i'm going to work on another video right now i just said work didn't i uh damn canadian accent one really 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 odd piece of news is that my single ladies dance has become a hit with my family in new zealand and apparently whenever they need to be cheered up they just watch it so um it's reached a couple of people that i didn't think that it would including a number of uncles that I haven't seen in years and years, so that is quite interesting.